and the features don't stop there. With S present, they just keep on coming. Let's have a look at buttons. You can choose from a vast range of different buttons that basically allow you to create a button that will hyperlink to a different site off your main presentation. Here we've got mastermedia.org. Uh, and then you can basically create the font color, the text, so decide what you want the button to say. And then when someone clicks on that button, that will take them to the link automatically. So here we go. If we click on this now, oh, there we go, Master New Media. So fantastic little feature for hyperlinking. There's loads of clip art as well, and if you like that kind of thing, which I'm not wild about, it does add a certain something to some presentations. This is fully scalable again, and you can put that where you like. It has to be said that the clip art is of a high quality, so that's definitely in their favour. There's also a vast image library, lots of different uh, buildings and different objects that you can just drop in there, and that's in addition to the clip art. So, you know, these are nice little features. Great thing also is that you can actually move them up and down the layers. It's fully layered so you can create sort of one image on top of another and decide which one comes first and which one comes second. Also we can create lists. Now I've just created the tsunami animation here but basically we've got our ability to create very simple lists and I'll show you what happens when we've actually finished those. The one that's actually selected will actually be highlighted slightly more than the others so we've got a rollover effect which is something you don't get in your average presentation. So these are again features that not only build upon the sort of basis of stuff like PowerPoint but actually expand on it and take it to the next level. So really really impressive feature set all in all.